Alpha Zeta and Ian Smith just blundered at that fence, but still have a good lead. Now C Mays, Chris Dawson now starts to get a little bit serious, gets a reminder, C Mays. Kings Blue is just struggling now at the back of the field, so there are four fences left to take. Alpha Zeta in James Binks's blue and green colours under Ian Smith. Jumps this next one, four out, looks a tired horse, went through the fence, C Mays giving chase in second, and then Kings Bloom. They look three fairly tired horses as they begin the run back towards home and three fences left to take. Alpha Zeta's out in front, C Mays giving chase in second, and then Kings Bloom. Here we are, three from the finish. Alpha Zeta comes in towards it, jump that one okay, and... Uh, C Mays not making too much impression at this stage, and nor too is Kings Bloom. There are two more fences left to take. Alpha Zeta just hanging slightly to its left, landed over two out with a lead of about eight or ten lengths, and uh, the other two are very tired, C Mays and Kings Bloom, not making any impression on the leader, who himself is tired, but has one more fence left to take here. Alpha Zeta just the last fence, and he's 15 to 20 clear here in Smith. Had a hairy ride out in front, but uh, he's managed to keep the partnership going and they run out a ready winner of the final race of the afternoon. Alpha Zeta and Ian Smith take it. Very tired horses and home in second was King's Bloom and C Mays finished in third.